everybody, it's Stacy with As The Tea Brews. Today I have an unboxing for you. I should say unbagging, I guess. It came in this, um, it says it's a compostable bag. And uh, I love that. I love that they are switching to something a little bit more earth friendly. So um, this is from David's Tea, if I didn't already say that. It comes in this beautiful teal color that is um, known to be a David's Tea bag and um, I'm super excited to, to open this. So I have not opened it yet and I don't remember what I ordered. Um, I do know that I ordered some things that were new to me, um, if not even new to David's Tea this year. I feel like I got some brand new stuff. So um, definitely let me know in the comments below if you want to see reviews on any of this. Um, I will work on that. And I'm just gonna get this first one out of the way because I'm, I'm pretty sure I only ordered one bag of this and you guys will guess this one if you've watched my videos before, but this is Lay Digestive. And this is one of our absolute favorite nighttime teas. We drink this several nights a week and um, I think I still have like five or six bags in the pantry, but I just threw it in because, you know, I love it. So I threw that one in. Um, okay, so let's see. You know what, there's a tiny, what is happening here? Are these samples? Oh, are they giving samples, you guys? What is happening here? Okay, wait. I have to see if there's like a packing slip or... I don't see a packing slip in here, um, which is seems unusual to me. Did they stop doing that? Are they just doing that because to save paper? Um, I'll have to go back and check my email and see what was on there for sure to know that everything was there. It says, thank you so much for the tea, love. Nothing feels better than knowing you trust us with your order because everything we brew, we brew it for you. So that's cute, it's a cute little card. Um, I guess it's been, I don't know, it hasn't been that long since I ordered, a month or two ago, because I think I had a big lay digestive order. Um, and then there's like two, two of these other postcards in here. So that was a little overboard. They must stuck together. Um, but this is like a little recipe card and it says spritz, but make it tea, fever tree and David's tea. They must have, is it an advertisement from fever tree? Um, seltzers or sodas. Uh, let's see, super orange mixed with lime soda and it has the ingredients. Oh, you know what? One of these is in French and one of them is in English. I feel like they should have put the directions for both on one card, um, but they sent me both. I guess they didn't know if I lived in Utah, if I spoke French or English, <laughs> uh, but I got both. So that actually sounds delicious, um, like a tea spritzer. Okay, so I ordered some stuff, but there are three that I can see right now, small little bags. So let me know in the comments below, are they sending samples again? Um, these are different than their old packaging samples, but I think these are samples. I have three of them. I have a Caribbean Crush, which I've had many, many times. Um, Super Ginger, I've had that one a lot. And then this one, the other one is Blood Orange Boost. Is that the, oh look. Okay, so the Blood Orange Boost um, recipe card and the blood orange boost sample. So that's fun because I did not have that tea and I couldn't have made this with that tea. So I'm super excited to try that. Um, yeah, super fun. I love samples. Samples are amazing. I wish that all companies did that because sometimes you just don't know if you love a tea or not until you try it. Okay, so let's just get into it. The first thing that I have here that I pulled out and I've read mixed things about some of these powders um, online and some of the Facebook groups and Facebook group chats. Um, but this is a superfood latte powder. It's organic. And this one is ashwagandha pumpkin. So this one, you mix it with, um, I think you just mix it with like milk or water. It says two matcha spoons, um, hot milk or a dairy-free alternative. Um, one cup and warm it up. So this one sounded really good to me. Um, very pumpkin-y and fallish. Hopefully it is good. It has organic pumpkin powder, organic oat milk powder, organic molasses powder, um, organic cinnamon powder, organic ginger powder, organic 
lacuma powder, organic ashwagandha powder, organic cardamom powder, and organic clove powder. So, um, yeah, I will for sure do a review on that one. And then I did order another one of their powders. This one is the Superfood Latte Powder Golden Sun. This is turmeric, ginger, black pepper, um, and it says just add milk. So um, I'm excited to try that. And this one just has, I'm not gonna say organic every time again, sorry. It's organic, all organic ingredients. Turmeric powder, molasses powder, mesquite powder, lacuma powder, am I saying that right? Ginger powder, date powder, and black pepper. And this one, um, yeah, I'm excited to try this one too. Okay, so like I said, I've heard mixed reviews. If you've tried them, let me know in the comments below. Um, but I will be letting you know what I think about them. And then it looks like I have three more teas. Okay, this one I got a long time ago. I don't know if they stopped making it or if I just stopped buying it, but I haven't had it for a long time. This is banana nut bread, and I really used to like this one. I feel like I steeped it a really long time when I made it, um, but it's really yummy, and it just... It, I just thought of fall and coziness, and so I wanted to get another bag. Um, so I haven't had that one for a very long time. This one, I have had this one before, but it just sounded really fallish and good to me. This is cardamom French toast, and this is a black tea, and this one was really delicious also. It was good as a latte and also good plain. Um, I liked it a lot. And then this is a new one to me, so I will try to remember to do a review. Um, and I can review the other ones if you guys are interested also. Just let me know in the comments and I will um, try my best to do those. This is Organic Coffee Break. And um, they had another coffee one a few months ago, which was a little sweet on the stevia side to me, but not bad. I'm trying to remember. It was a puer. I can't remember the name of it. Um, but this one is a little different. And this one has no caffeine. It's an herbal. And so I love coffee, I love tea, I'm very excited to try this, and I love that it's caffeine free so I can drink it later in the day or in the evening. Um, yeah, so that's it, that's my order. I hope you guys enjoyed watching the video. Um, drop me a comment if you have thought about ordering any of these teas or if you ordered some of them yourself or what else you ordered from their fall releases and I will see you guys next time. Have a great day, bye.